Hey everybody, welcome back. We've got uh, Johnny, of all people, running past us earlier, and here he is. Oh, to enter or not to enter, that is the question. Wherefore does this philosophical quandary torment me? You totally get where I'm coming from, right? Oh, totally. <laughs> I knew it! Let me guess, after you've had your fun, you fall into a spiral of shame and self-loathing. But it only lasts Don't we a moment, all. doesn't it? Next thing you know, you're right back here again. Huh? Got a question for me? Seen Tifa around? Tifa? My love? My light? Who are you and how do you know her? No, shut up. I don't care. Tifa's here? Why? Tell me why! Oh god, no. I did this to her, didn't I? She came looking for me to beg me not to leave her. <sighs> Snap out of it, Johnny. Your Tifa needs you! Tifa, I'm coming, baby! <laughs> <laughs> Who was that? I think he might be in for a surprise. One need to know. Well, he's alive. I mean, I guess that's good. Okay, so let's get over to where we're trying to get to. Uh, we're going to go left here. We'll hang a Larry. And we hang a Roger. And head in. Wait a sec. Not yet. There's shopping to be done. Hello. What's this? Hey there. Are you looking for anything in particular today? Please, feel free to look around. It would be cool if we could change up our gear. I don't think these handbags are going to go with my sword, though, so... For now, let's get out of here. Nothing there. Nothing gets the blood pumping. Can we go in here yet? Nope. At some point, it looks like. You have a weapon specialist over here. Welcome to Walmart's premier weapon shop. Okay, hard edge. A mighty blade able to cleave in one stroke anything foolish enough to stand in the wielder's way. So. Higher attack than what we have. It's got three slots. Wind up and unleash an overhead strike. Increases damage on stagger. Costs two ATB. Yeah, I think so. I think we have the masters of all of our other skills. Um, eventually, we're going to get into, I guess, Caligonus bracelets for everybody. Just so that we have as many uh, materia slots as possible. This might be some new stuff. Supernatural wrist guards. Increases strength by 10%. Increases vitality by 10%. Increases magic power by 10%. And increases spirit by 10%. Headband. Become immune to sleep. Yes. Anything with an immunity, we're going to pick up. So if we see a fight coming, we can just throw that on. I almost wonder if we should get multiple of those. I think we'll hold for now. Do come again. Yeah, you got it. Nothing. Okay, so let's do a quicker comparison here. So we've been rolling with our Buster Sword for a bit. Uh, oh, the Nail Bat! I didn't realize this was a weapon! We got this from the, uh... Where did we get this from? We saw, like, a kid carrying it. I don't remember picking this up at all. So, triple slash buster sword. 100% proficiency. This thing is weak. That's Actually, it's not even that bad. This is a pretty significant improvement on overall damage. Let's get the Infinity's End. Uh, we'll become proficient, and then we'll try out the Bat at some point. Actually, you know what? Yeah, the Bat's going to be tough, because there's no Materia slots. Let's go Hard Edge, and we'll reslot. And then... I'm going to throw on the Headband. No, we won't. We'll do the Salvation thing. And let's upgrade this.
So we'll look for slots first. Attack power. Aerial attack damage, crippling damage. Stagger Siphon. What's that do? We'll have to unlock a couple to get there, I think. Wait, can I just pick it up? Oh, maybe I can. Recover HP when dealing damage with unique abilities to a staggered enemy. Yes. Yes, please. What else do we want to take? Buff durations? Probably not. It, this is all seems to be attack power. Punisher mode, strong attack damage, 5% boost. We'll take this. Percentage-wise, I think we're going to get bigger limits than just the plus fours. Uh, increases damage dealt to discrete enemy parts. That could be pretty good. Especially against bosses. Aerial attacks are pretty specific. And then we can just take... Uh, the attack power increases here. We'll hold the rest. We just need one more to be able to get to the next one, so. Cool, new sword. Awesome. Let's roll. Did not expect to find that. I wish I would have noticed that baseball Check bat, though. Uh... I think we might have found our man. And he's a gaudy one. Yeah. Unfortunately, we can't see him yet. Let's just see where this leads. This might be bad for us. Yeah, see, this is taking us out. Well, it's... Hold on. Looks like it's closed off, so we might find something back here, actually. If I had to hazard a guess, we likely are coming back here at some other point. Ah, oh, we're locked. Yeah. Okay. Avalanche. Haha, <laughs> cool. Very cool. Okay, so maybe if we find a key at some point to unlock that gate. Or maybe we get escorted there. Who knows? This area is so jam-packed with stuff. It's kind of cool. And every area we've been through has actually been uh, r dramatically different. Even in terms of layout, right? You get into the first area with Seventh Heaven. It's like kind of open. Uh, everything's almost like in a circular thing. You're running around the whole area. And then you get into here and it's all these super tight little alleyways. Really easy to get lost. Not a bad haul. Okay, let's just go in for now. I feel like I've entered a fairy tale. Not so fast, buddy. Let's back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah. So? So people can't just walk through the Don's front door. Especially men. How about me then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute! Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Jeez. Loud? 
Requesting permission to Permission go. granted, go. Denied. Oh. If you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're gonna need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. That's our way in, I guess. Okay, let's go chat him up. Like, just look at that. That is so cool. It's gorgeous. Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas. Not really. So that's the way it is. <laughs> Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! Don't screw it up, Johnny, please. <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? No, unfortunately. Okay, so we've got... Is this through here? Don't think it's going to connect, but what is this anyway? Like a weird little, I guess this is a bar. Oh yeah, hip hop to Chocobo. Oh, that's playing outside on the other side. That's what it is. Thank you. I signed with Shinra Records a while back, but I'm still looking for my first big hit. Are you serious? It's been seven years now. Not easy, but you gotta do what you love. And I love to sing. There you this go, is buddy. A new song of mine. Maybe it'll be that number one. The Midgar Blues. Yeah, I can see this being number one. Let's get y'all a table. Bieber with Yummy. And then number two is the Midgar Blues. Remember us? Not you two again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, here's out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty, please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? What do you have in mind? Just a simple heads or tails? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails. Wow. Yes, right. I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> no pressure. Yes, wrong. And you'll leave me in peace. Ooh, or we have a no deal. Get us in. No thanks. Oh, not a gambler, huh? I am Ted's. <laughs> huh? Uh, of course. Tails, you lose. Good job. I would have guessed heads anyway. 
Hey, don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. But if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. Well, That's thanks, why Sam. It's trio, and not just the Mio. Now skedaddle. This is going to be tough, Wait. isn't it? Mind if I see that coin of yours? Oh, really? God damn it. He played us. Trick coin. I had a hunch. That's cheating. And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. Okay, well, that's one guy down. Let's see if we have luck with any of the others. Oh, we did get his coin, though. Sam's coin. Two-sided coin given by Chocobo Sam is consolation. Both sides are etched with an image of a Chocobo. Alright. Okay, so Rodea's up above us. We also have... Let's go to Madam M here down the Welcome alley to first. The world of tomorrow. Any item you can... ah. <laughs> or not. I guess they're closed right now. Madam M. Come back after talking with the other members of the trio. Okay. Andrea it is. Can you let us in now? Oh, look who it is. Excuse me, Johnny. Damn, man. This the place? It's supposed to go down like this. I think so. Uh, I just let me handle this. Andrea. You wait out here, okay? Will. And why would I do that? Like, no, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that... You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. <laughs> oh, man. She's right. The, another thing they do a really good job of in this area is... Just the overwhelming sounds and, like, lights to make it very distracting. Very Vegas-like. Oh, we're going to see her in here, uh, Folia. Good evening. Oh. Hey, uh. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honeybee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh, we don't have an appointment. I see. I'm <laughs> terribly sorry, sir. I hate that reaction. An appointment is required, and the earliest available slot is three years from now. <laughs> three years?! All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes. Well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare, but Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh, well. Let's try someone else. Two dead ends. Andrea doesn't see anyone without an appointment. All right, so we'll go back to her. Hey, are you nervous too? Was Folia back <laughs> in wait. here? I'm so excited, I can't breathe. I think so, right? Is she still back here? Yeah, she is. I've always wanted to dance for a living. I practice every second I can. I keep. I'm it's wondering the if I'll become the best. If there's a way that she can kind of hook us up there, but it seems like that's just maybe Gotta stay sharp, though. showing how drastic the different lifestyles can be. Oh, there's something back here too. Marlita's 
the greatest honey girl there oh, these freaking guys. It's an is this, a, is this the same group that was blocking the previous one? It's always best to be prepared for the worst, wouldn't you agree? Oh, different. Quality monster insurance is more essential than ever these days. <sighs> monster <laughs> insurance. You might want to sign up for disability insurance. Like now. I can get What's that? You're very interested in the coverage we offer? Only our premium policy will do for you, sir. It's always best to be prepared for the okay. worst. Wouldn't you agree? So maybe these clear during the day or something? No, no way! You've lost your marbles, man! My marbles are secure, sir. Tis you who are crazy. Do the loop again. You tried their seasonal stuff? Only took it. Oh, he's been in every place we've gone. <laughs> Welcome, welcome. Just the two of you? Step right up. Now then, what manner of massage do you desire? Say what? Oh, okay. Is this your first time in our establishment? Mm hmm We are a hand massage parlor. Oh. An excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task a yes, terrible that's, strain. Yes, that's what I expected it to be. It is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension. <laughs> And what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don Cook. Of... Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh. Uh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services... Then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well... <laughs> hmm... Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me. Oh. The, do you the feel? Is there tension firm there? The hands of a fighter, yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. I mean, let's okay, be honest. The sword Claude. gives it away. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? Ooh. I mean, <laughs> we've been saving our gill. And we're going to go with a luxury course. <laughs> I'm sure that'll be worth our money. And wait. Cloud? When in Rome. <laughs> this exclusive treatment is reserved for our most well to do patrons. First, the hand cream. A generous coating for each and every one of your richly deserving fingers. Let's start with the tips. That's it. Relax. I'm only here to help. Oh, did that hurt? No. <laughs> Then I'll move on to the base of the fingers. Let's see if we can't improve your circulation and get that blood flowing. I'm slightly uncomfortable. <laughs> oh, no, don't fight it. Stress is poison to the body. And finally, some gentle stimulation for the palm. No more than a touch. Just like this. Oh, what was that? A cry of pleasure. 
Is this how you like it? How about this? Uh oh. Maybe this. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, I will say I've had massages before, appropriate ones, and they do do your hands sometimes, and it is a great feeling. But I don't know if I can say if that. That was it's your liking. Do come. That on. good. Right. We spent three thousand dollars on that. Three thousand. How was it? Huh? Huh? <laughs> oh, we're Aerith now. Are you okay? Cool. Yeah. Get a massage from Madam M as a sign of good faith, which we've done. You're acting weird, Cloud. I am. Really weird. I think he just needs a moment. Hmm. Think you'll make a habit of it? All right then. I think I've seen everything I need to see. So, tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. We need you to get us into Corneo. Or Corneo. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm. Okay. Really? But you cannot go dressed like that. Huh? I could never send Corneo a candidate wearing such a plain looking getup. Doing Ouch. so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? Uh, <laughs> looks comfortable is no better than it's all right. Does it matter what I think? It matter what I think? Well, I think it's pretty cool. Yeah, I mean. Look, just take fine. it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So, what should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So as long, long as, it as you can afford it. Oh, I was just going to say, as long as it doesn't cost what a million gil. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight club? Oh, hell yes. Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes, for the person who got you in. <laughs> so, what do you say? I'm 100% in. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry, run along. Okay. Now we're speaking my language. Do we have anything back here, I wonder? Nope, oh, just the uh, room of pleasure. It's been real. Uh, one thing I noticed when we were going through our inventory, these manuscripts, uh, we can't, we're not doing anything with these. These are just to show that we have them, right? I think so. What have we gotten ourselves into? Nothing good. I wouldn't expect a fair fight in this town. Think nope. we can win it all? There's something. That's one thing I'm definitely sure of. <laughs> I appreciate the confidence. Just don't get too cocky, okay? Yeah. Try my best. Uh, one thing we should consider is our new weapon skill. Uh, let's go from here. So this hard edge. This costs two ATB. Wind up and unleash an overhead strike. Increases damage on stagger as well. Um, does that play into this intel thing? Yeah, increase stagger damage bonus to 200. So maybe, maybe that can go with that. Cool. All right, tell you what, let's take a break here. When we come back, we're going to take on some fights, I guess. And if we're successful... Oh, that's back here. Uh, no, it's not. It's up this way. What is this first before we wrap it up? Oh, it's a gym. Let's 
Don't mind if I do. Headband. Oh, are you freaking serious? <laughs> this is the thing we bought for 1,500... Uh, 1,500 gil. Becoming immune to sleep. You know what? Fine. So we have two of them now, right? What? That's fine. So it was a two-for-one deal. That's how I'm choosing to look at it. Cool. All right. So we'll wrap it up here, and then when we come back, uh, we'll go into these fights, and hopefully she gives us a dress we can wear, and we'll be on our way. See you soon. Bye for now.